Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning, wherever you're at. So uh, I decided to do something kind of cool. Never done this before. <clears throat> it's kind of like a little foodie uh, review. I went to um, a uh, Asian market today, and um, I had to go get some noodles. And I said, you know what? Look at this stuff. This is kind of cool. Why don't I... Uh, try this kind of strange stuff and uh, throw it on YouTube. So what I did is I got some stuff. So um, let's give them a try. I'll show you what I got. And um, sorry about my camera here. I got about six different things and they're kind of, kind of cool. So I'm kind of thinking, of, I'm going to start with this. Okay, this is a cinema popcorn hot spicy um, artificially hot chicken flavored. And uh, this is what it looks like. And um, pretty interesting. It sounds like it's already popped. I think it is. So... Um, I'm not going to go with the ingredients because I don't want to spend like 20 minutes here going over all these ingredients, but there's a whole gaggle of them. If you can see a lot of, a lot of ingredients back there, 190 calories. And uh, I'm sure there's a ton of salt content in there. So uh, let's go ahead and open it up. Like I, like I thought, they are uh, already there. It smells kind of good. That's what it looks like. It smells actually kind of a little different, but uh, let's go ahead and give these a try. You know what? To be honest, they're not bad. They're um, they're pretty tasty, um, and it's not really spicy. You know, it's got a little teeny kick to it, a little tingle. But um, actually, I could eat this whole whole container of it, man. They're really good. Wow, that's actually really good. I'm impressed with that. So, um, I can't see anybody over there on my, uh, leaving comments over there, but there they are. Well, so tasty. I'm actually going to take another bite of them. They're really, really good. These are super delicious. If the store was over by me, I would probably buy them all the time. Because this is actually really good. I learned how to make it myself and put the seasonings out of popcorn. Okay. Let's go to the second one. After popcorn, you probably want something to drink, right? So uh, let's move this out of the way a little bit. Probably need something to drink. So... Uh, I'm not sure what this is. I'm not sure if you can really see the floaties in there. See? Um, it's different. It's definitely different. It's called a basil seed. Basil seed mixed fruits flavored drink. And uh, it's kind of strange looking. You know, it looks like there's like these things in there that are alive. But uh, let's go ahead and try it. I'm kind of, actually, I'm real, kind of afraid of this right here. This is kind of, smells fruity. You know, like that blue dye smell. F mixed fruits, smell, whatever. But uh, it's a honeybee. 
whatever that means. See the little honeybee focus. There it is. The honeybee. And um, same thing. I'm not going to go to all the ingredients because there's a billion of them in there. Or a million. So, focus. Come on. But uh, there's a whole bunch in there. But let's give it a try. Wow. It's actually really good. It's kind of weird. It's actually really delicious, to be honest. It's good. That's actually really good. I was surprised. Not really sweet. It's it's pretty delicious. Put that there because we might need to drink after some of this other stuff over here. Ugh. Um, I'm gonna save a couple for the la for the end. All right, let's go with this one. This is called Marine Boy something, and it's uh, not fried baked snacks. Orion is the name of the the company. Um, there it is, and. Uh, Looks good. I mean, Marine Boy. But um, let's, let's see. Where's the, yeah, same thing. You know, there's a whole bunch of stuff in there. And uh, I want to spend all the time going over all that stuff. It's a product of Korea. And we're going to give it a try. Now, I notice on top there's like this little tab. Let's pull the tab. Almost like a, when you buy one of those freezer mills. So it's cute, you know. Take them out. I guess you can drop them inside your little box here. Heather. <laughs> They're, they're actually kind of cute. I was thinking these were going to be like, you know, the little uh, fishies, che cheese fishies, but uh, they're actually not. They're kind of hollow inside. And they're a little sweet. See how they're hollow inside? They're hollow inside. We have like a little, uh, I don't know, some type of a fish. Got stars. I don't know what this is. Oh, looks like a whale. But they're pretty good. They're not real sweet. But they're actually a really good snack. That is like the th three things that are pretty amazing. This is a scary fish, you know. Oh, wow. They have a little seafood taste to them. These actually have seafood taste. I'm tasting seafood. Um, not sure what. This, that's a dolphin. And we got a little like guy there. Like, ah. But, ah. Try it one more time. They're not too bad. Are pretty good, but it does have a seafood taste. Wow, different. All right, what's next? Let's go with uh, we're gonna go with the crunch and then we're gonna save those two for last. So I got three more here. So this one's kind of cool. I thought this was neat, and I think I've seen these before. It's called Papusha, Papushu, Papushu, Noodle Snacks, Snacks de Noodles. Um, don't boil it, smash it. Bulgogi bol, flavor, Bulgogi flavor. And uh, it's like a ramen. And you're supposed to smash it. And um, 420 calories. Uh, it's a product of Korea. 
And on the back, once again, you can see all the uh, ingredients there. You know, there's a good amount of ingredients. And uh, it shows you right there what to do. You know, smash it, shake it, all the seasoning. So we're gonna do this. You know, I'm kind of guessing that the noodles, not really a healthy thing because they're kind of raw and they got to swell, swell up and slide, you know, your stomach or something. So, let's just smash. Uh, and then shake it up. That's just pretty good. It's got to be good. So far, everyone's doing pretty good. Those other two, ooh, I don't know. I need a drink. I'm going to take a drink before this because... I'm thirsty. Oh, that's so different. Okay. Oh, well, shaking it up didn't help because we got to put this in there. It's like a, a ramen mixture type thing. Let's go ahead and do that. I want to get this stuff on my bed. Okay, then we're going to shake it, shake it. So uh, this is almost like, like ramen, it smells like it, probably the same similar stuff, but we just eat it out of the package. All right, now how's that look? Smell it? Smells pretty good. I smell it. I just give it a try. Yeah. You know, it's like I expected. Um, it's like ramen noodles with the seasoning. And um, it's not bad except for the noodles. I just, I'm not a big fan. So kind of a thumbs down with this guy. But the seasoning's good. Don't boil it, smash it. You're all right. Wow. I definitely need a drink after eating that. Moose, you made it in. I'm uh, trying some weird stuff out, man. Look at this drink. All right. So I'm deck to my last two here. And I'm going to leave the other one for last because these ones are kind of like a trip. This is uh, some type of a fish something on a stick. There's the ingredients, our stuff, whatever's in it. Oh, it says warning. There's a warning sign. What's the warning say? It's too, too, the lettering's too small, of course. I don't know. It just says warning. So uh, let's open this up. It's called a, and I can't even pronounce it, stick. And, uh, we're going to open it up check it out. Yeah, it's definitely fish. But look at, they're kind of cool. It means I got to eat a whole one. I mean, I'm not afraid to eat these, you know. But um, there's what it looks like. And... Uh, Kind of interesting. Come on, focus. I like those cameras when they don't focus. Come on, focus. But um, there it is. Let's go ahead and give this a try. 
and um, uh, I don't know, man. I'll just take the stick off and uh, just go for it. Wow. Oh, they're strong. I gotta eat the whole thing. But um really fishy tasting. I think like having some type of a seafood meal and putting these on the side would be kind of a cool thing. They're not bad. But um Really fishy tasting. Seasoning is, you know, I like the seasoning. The texture is really different. Did that say lizard fish? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to read it. <laughs> I don't know if it said li lizard fish, but uh, wow. Wait till you see this next one, Moose. You might have already saw it. Are you ready? You ready for this? You ready, Moose? Oh, I need a drink. A drink of my basil seed uh, fruit drink. All right. Tracy. Say, say a prayer for me, because this is definitely going to be up there of the kind of a strange stuff that I've ever ate. Roasted squid. This says roasted squid. Bring it on. <laughs> and uh, there's the ingredients back there. And uh, it's not too bad. I mean, I like squid. You know, squid's okay. But um, now I don't have to eat the whole thing. I just have to try it. Let's go ahead and open this up. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh. I'm trying to smell it. Can you smell it? You're not supposed to. I can't smell nothing. <laughs> you want to smell it? This is rough. This is rough. This is a rough one. All right. Well, the smell is pretty hard, you know. And uh, this is what it looks like. And um, we're going to eat this whole piece. This should be interesting. You know what? I'm telling you, this is interesting. And you don't ever think about it. You just go for it. I like the taste. Of course, it's like a jerky. And it's really chewy. And it's like jerky, so I got to chew this for like 20 minutes chomping down on it, right? It is not my fave. I only eat squid if it's calamari. Just the body, though. <laughs> Yeah. So, got to eat it. There you go. Wow. Squirrel. Dude. Well, I'm going to show you real quick what I ate. Some fish, some ramen stuff. Boy, this squid is really weird. It was not. I'm not a fan. I'm, I'm having a rough time with it right now. Roasted squid. Do you know cheater? I'm not sure. 
but right now I'm having a moment. This stuff, crackers. Here, let's mix some crackers in that thing because it's tasting really weird. And what else? Oh, this is the best right here. Oh, my goodness. That stuff is just not. I am not a fan of that stuff. I'm a fan of the popcorn. And then, last thing, this stuff. The basil seeds. Drink here. That looks really weird. Looks like brains. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Jenna's husband. Nice. The crackers are good. They're okay. They're a little, a little teeny bit of fishy taste. The best out of all this, this popcorn. This popcorn is not that spicy. And it's freaking amazing. Jenny, good to see you in here. Wow. Should I pop people up for a minute? I've never done that before. Yogi. Um, let's see if this pops you guys up in here. I don't even know how to do this. Be the first time. I'll throw it out here. Does that work? Oh, my goodness. Different stuff. The only reason why I bring up Cheddar is that he wants to review jerky on his channel. Wow. You could suggest this one. for You know what? That would be sweet. Go and uh, have some different. Click and bite and copy and paste the link. You got it. Yep. That's what I kind of dig. So whoever wants to come up here, you guys can come up. I've never done it. I've never done this before. So it'll be the first time I've. I've done live chats all the time, but I've never invited to talk to people before. So, but um, please come up, you know, I don't know. I've never done it. So, it's fun. Someone do it. <laughs> right, Yogi? I appreciate you coming in, though, man. That's awesome. How many, how many people I got here? Five. All right, Moose, you got to come up. Now, now what do I got to do? Do I got to like pay people to come up in my chat? <laughs> Is that how this works? <laughs> Be right back. I'll come up, but no camera still. Oh, no, I don't care if you're on camera. I know who you are. This popcorn is not bad. I'm probably crunching it. You know what? This stuff, I am not gonna lie. Got look. There you go. Is nasty. I hate to say that about somebody's stuff, but it's just not me. It's it was harsh. I saved the worst for last. And then um, the fish one was okay. It was tolerable. This one was tolerable. You know, this one right here was. It's still. It's. It's it's just different, man. And then the ramen is just like, ugh. But the popcorn, the drink, and the little guys here are pretty good. This looks nasty. Yeah, you got to taste it. You know, you ever eat some, like, as I crunch. You ever eat some, like, really cheap jerky, and you're just chomping on it? And it's just chomping, you're chomping. It's take 10 minutes for this tiny little piece. That's what that is. But it's chomping plus that nasty taste. So you just can't swallow it. And my body's probably going, what the hell's wrong with you? So what else? What else has everybody got going on? Tomorrow is Monday. Smash that thumbs up, everybody. 
Yeah, thank you, Yogi. I got three in there. Watch this. I can make it four and do it myself, too. Oh, now I got four. I like my own set. Oh, we got five. Five likes, including mine. Awesome. I heard it go beep in my ear. Off tomorrow, thank God. Nice. Day off tomorrow. That's good. What kind of work do you do? How is that personal? It's okay if it's personal. I'm in the basement. Oh, hey. Somebody's in the basement. Hello. 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 What is going on, young lady? Uh, not much. Not much? You doing good? Eh, life stuff, you know. Yeah. Oh, I know. Trust me. I love this popcorn. What do you think of this nasty stuff I ate? Um, That's squid. I only eat bodies of squid. As mm -hmm. I mentioned, as calamari, so no. Yeah. But the popcorn seems doable. Yeah, the popcorn's good. The little fishy, you know, crackers are good. Uh, that drink, believe it or not, is really good. What is it? I still can't figure it out. I know. I I couldn't even tell you. I mean, look at how those little floaties are in there, you know? But what does it taste like to you? Um, it tastes like a like a fruit punch. You see that? Look at that. Floaties, really yeah. Weird. What are they? Um I'm I don't know. They're like seeds. They say it's basil seed. Oh, so that's what's floating around, I guess. Yeah. But it's pretty good. They had all kinds of flavors, and I'm like, oh, well, we'll, we'll try that. You're daring. I like mm -hmm. that about you. Yeah, well, you saw me do my one chip challenge and, like, throw up. Yeah. So, you know, that was that was nuts. Mental health and addiction Clint, oh, clinical supervisor. Oh, nice. So you have to babysit some people. This is what you have to do. Yeah, uh, my wife is a, uh, she's a medical assistant. That's cool. Yeah. I think you were, that, isn't that what you used to do, Moose? No, I like Chatio. I work in a public library. Okay, nice. Yeah, I'm like <laughs> Chatio. I want yeah. to get out of library land. Yeah, libraries have changed big time late. Well, know. the li I'll just make a brief statement. The library I work, maybe it doesn't always look from the outside as mm -hmm. modern as other buildings. Right. But our attitude of how we approach libraries are modern. So we do more than a lot of other libraries. Right. Okay, and so you're doing a lot of... And we keep up. So, like, for example, you can rent video games at my library. Mm -hmm. So, it's not bad in what libraries offer, but as work goes, it's definitely time to do something else. Right. right. So, I'm in a job search phase now. Yes. Hey, Yogi. Yeah, you take care. I appreciate you stopping in. You take it easy. And uh, I really appreciate you stopping in and checking me out, eating weird stuff. Come so back. I, I'm sure Mojo would appreciate it. Yep, definitely come back. Um, in the morning. I, 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 yeah, Saturday mornings is when I do my live feeds. Usually, I usually don't go in the, you know, on a different day. But I thought I'd do something different today. But Saturday mornings, I do a breakfast, and I never know what I'm making, and it comes out interesting. So, so you make it up on the fly. Well, kind of. It, sometimes it'll hit me the night before. That's cool. I want to know how you ate that burger. It was so huge. You know, right? You I didn't ask for what you do. Well, you're supposed to smash it down. I didn't get one of those burgers <laughs> because I didn't expect the, the many people that came because I ended up having probably six, seven people there. Six people, I think. And, uh, wow. and so I had to, you know, once again, come up with some other stuff too because I only got enough for three people because that's what I thought was going to be there and that I fed them instead of myself, of course. So, yep. Good night. You take care. But, uh, yeah, it was, it was definitely a trip. So. You're lucky you get to see me on Saturdays. Usually I'm at work. Are you? Mm -hmm. So I mean, there's a possibility you might not see me next month. Just so okay. you're aware. 
Yeah. So you yeah. The rule is I have to work one evening. If I don't choose to work one evening, it's got to be on the weekend. Yeah. And Sundays yeah. are boring, so I would rather choose Saturday. But I'm probably going to do an evening. Yeah. You, do you like evenings? Do I like what? Working evenings. I don't actually care. Yeah. Because my work is flexible enough where it lets me choose what I want in my mm -hmm. department. We have to choose it a month uh, out. That's just the way it's always been. And right. my boss usually goes, you want this? Fine. Unless she thinks there's too many people who want it on the same day or somebody has class or something where they have to work another day. Mm -hmm. So I don't make a big to-do about it. Whether I like it or not, Yeah. I don't make a big to-do. Do you uh, work 12-hour days? No. Okay. I'm I'm not full time, unfortunately. That's my problem. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of library jobs aren't, but we don't need to get into my, my rant. Mm-hmm. Right. So back to your food. Are you mm -hmm. gonna try other kind of cuisines, uh different foods on your channel? You know, I, I, I think I might. I think, you know, once maybe once a month do something like this. You know? Ooh. Or maybe once a week. Uh, it, I try to only keep it down to like two things during the week. So if I start doing three or four, it's just, it's overwhelming. People aren't going to, they barely have enough time to watch one thing, let alone two. But who knows? It just, it all depends. I, I might go alive and do this because it's pretty easy. I don't have to edit anything. Like I have to edit a video by Tuesday and put it out. And, um, it takes time, and it's only me. I do the editing, I do the filming, I do I get it. all that stuff. So it's just a lot of work. So, and then I work full time. So right. So maybe your once a month idea might be better for your schedule. Mm -hmm. It might, but I think you know, come up with a different day during the week. Maybe like a Thursday. Well, Thursday is a full day of a lot of people on there. It all depends. I don't know. It'd be fun. I, it's fun. But the and problem is I'm running into is when the live stream, because I did, I, I did two times. And then one time I noticed everyone went live. So I'm mm -hmm. like, well, then what's the point? But you get to a point where everyone does it. You just mm -hmm. have to work with what's in your schedule. Yep, exactly. Not, you can't worry about everybody else. And they, they understand. It's just when you can go live, you go live. You know. And everyone's got an opinion because I've been told many things now since I went live. Mm -hmm. It's crazy yeah. what people think works or doesn't work. Mm -hmm. so oh, yeah. Just do what works for everybody on YouTube and have fun. Yep, exactly. Unless you want to take it uber, uber seriously, then that's a whole different mm -hmm. um, ballgame. Exactly. Like, see, with me, it's like I have a three-year plan, you know, and I'll see where I'm at in three years. You mean with YouTube or life? With YouTube. And oh. I'll, I'll ret and I'm going to retire in three years, so I'm going to see. Oh, that's right. I remember you mentioned Yeah. That. Yeah. So it'll be, uh, we'll see. We'll see what but goes you're on. Too young, but you look too young to retire. Well, I'll still work. I'll do something different. It's just, I'll be oh, definitely you're done. transition. Yeah. I'll definitely be done with what I'm doing. Even though it's good money, but... I got to go to the next level. Well, know, so. as long as you are striving for happiness, I think mm -hmm. that's what's important. Oh, yeah. Because yep. I've done a job that I don't like for way too long, and it's no way to live life. Yeah, exactly. Wanna, so you... My opinion is have something that you can semi-tolerate mm -hmm. so you don't have to be, oh, this is the worst thing. You know, you could just enjoy life. Right. That's where I'm at. Yeah. But what it is I want to do, don't ask. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, I saw, so I um, what I did was I asked for a bunch of help with organizations in Illinois, and mm -hmm. we'll see where that goes. And I did a webinar. So now I'm going to rewrite my resume and go from there. <clears throat> oh, cool. Nice. Yeah, well, that's that's good. I mean... If you're not happy, you need, you know, I'm not do, with my do something. Employment. And Chadio, I think, is the same way, isn't he? Yeah, we both want to escape library land. Yeah, that's only that's he's smart. 
He's doing it way early. Mm -hmm. I stayed way too long. How many years? Uh, like past 10. Wow. Yeah, that's a chunk. Same place? Mm -hmm. Yep. Wow. Now, well, when you say a library, is it a local library or a school library? No, it's a public library in my town. Okay. We have, in Illinois, almost every town, as far as I'm aware, all the towns, at least in my county, have a public um, library. A public library. Yeah. Whereas Chicago, I think it's by so many blocks or, because there's more, there's a bunch of different ones in Chicago. Really? Mm -hmm. hmm. I think that's how urban libraries are. There's many different branches. Mm -hmm. Wow. But anyways, it's a new time for us all. And I met yeah. a whole bunch of new people like you. Yep. Isn't that fun? It's it's so nice. And uh, like they always say, everybody is so nice. And most, most of the time, everybody in all these chats are so nice. You know, you good are. people. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. But um, I've you know, and then I've seen some channels where they start arguing over stuff, and I don't, I don't. Yes, of, I, don't know I, I know what you mean. But um, so. I find the communities that I see you in, everyone is really nice, mm -hmm. and I don't think anybody's like fake. Yeah. Oh no, no. I mean, we're like everybody. We're all we're all human. We all have our like issues in life and different things that that are going on which, you know, a lot of times people won't bring up, you know, but it, it's out there. And it, it, and it's like Facebook. You go on there and people are just going to show you their happy side. Well, and, and you don't see their unhappy side at all or anything like that, which is, I mean. is, once the live button is off, then you find out this group of people. Uh -huh. you, just <laughs> yeah. on, you just don't see it on live. Mm-hmm. Because there are some things people just don't want to put out for the whole wide world. Right. Because a lot of us became very good friends. That's why. Right. Right. Exactly. But if you try to explain this to people not on YouTube, they don't get it. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I don't tell my family about it. I, oh. just, I just tell them I have a channel. Mm, that's it. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. See, if they're not interested. They think it's weird. So I'm like, okay, forget about you. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna end up coming off now. It's, All right. I'm, I need to. I need to go get ready for bed and take care of my wife wherever she is. I think she might have the the COVID now. So. Oh no. Yeah. So we'll we'll find out. She did a test and and she's in the medical field. So and it's been going around. In I her, wish in her, well. Yeah, well, I appreciate that. Thank you. But uh, you have a good week, you know, and I Thank hope you, you have a I hope you have an amazing week, you know, you too. and all that good stuff. But uh, you take care. All right. And thanks right. for watching, everybody. Yes. Do I have anybody in here? I have three people in here. You guys are. Hey, yeah. So you got to teach me to be nice. Right. And uh, polite and tell people. Thank you. <laughs> right. Yep. Hey, everybody. Thank you. Whoever's out there. Um, and come back. Yep. And come back and all that good stuff. And uh, I will see you guys next week. See Take you. care. Yep. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.